Drake Bell is speaking out on the bombshell allegations that he was abused by Nickelodeon Dialogue coach Brian Peck. The Drake and Josh alum details the extensive and brutal sexual abuse he says he experienced in the new Investigation Discovery docuseries, Quiet on Set, The Dark Side of Kids TV. According to Drake, Peck apologized, but still the abuse became worse and worse before the Dialogue coach was eventually convicted of sexually abusing an unknown child actor in 2004 and sentenced to 16 months in jail. In the docuseries, Drake identifies himself as that star and says that what he experienced led to a lot of self-destruction. After years of trauma, Drake dealt with substance abuse issues and in 2021, he pled guilty to a child endangerment charge. When prosecutors found he once sent inappropriate social media messages to a 15-year-old girl he met online. In 2023, he was briefly reported missing and received a mental health evaluation once police found him. The new documentary has taken the internet by storm and Drake has been weighing in on the response on social media. He slammed Boy Meets World star Will Friedle and Ryder Strong for backing Peck in court with letters in 2004. The duo discussed how they deeply regretted their decision in a February episode of their podcast, Pod Meets World. Drake also called Ned's declassified star Devin Werkheiser, Lindsay Shaw, and Daniel Curtis Lee declassless after they joked about the investigative series on TikTok Live. One person he did defend was his co-star Josh Peck, despite the duo having a rocky relationship. Drake asked fans not to hate on Josh after they denounced him for not speaking out publicly about the horrifying allegations. I just want you guys to know that he has reached out to me and um, it's, it's been very uh, sensitive, um, but he has reached out to, uh, uh, to talk with me and, and help me work through this and, and uh, has been really, really great. Josh later released a statement of his own on Instagram saying in part, I reached out to Drake privately, but want to give my support for the survivors who were brave enough to share their stories of emotional and physical abuse on Nickelodeon sets with the world. Children should be protected. Following Brian Peck's conviction, Drake says Nickelodeon producer Dan Schneider tried to comfort him, but Dan has been accused of emotional abuse himself. Multiple former child stars detailed his alleged sexism, racism, and inappropriate workplace behavior in Quiet on Set. The former producer, who was the creator behind several of Nickelodeon's top shows, broke his silence during an interview with Boogie, who played Tebow on iCarly. Watching over the past two nights was very difficult, me facing my past behaviors. Um, some of which are embarrassing and that I regret, and I definitely owe some people a pretty strong apology. As more details come to light from the documentary, we've got you covered. Stick with page6.com.